Hi, I'm Sheena Joy. I'm a macrame textile artist, and I'm here to simply inspire you to do the same. If that's your jam, subscribe and hit the bell notifications. To make this project super simple, I cut the cord all at the same length. So on our working cord, we're going to tie 12 lark's head knots. The day I had filmed this project was January 7th, which is a special day because it happens to be my birthday, hence the reason why I'm making a crown. Because if there's any day to be extra, it is your birthday. Okay, so moving along, we're going to tie square knots straight across. As per usual, if I'm going too fast for you, I do have a knot tutorial playlist that I invite you to go check out. I'm going to keep the first knot in real time, but after that, we're just going to speed through. Okay, so let's carry on with the rest of our square knots. Similar to my previous video, I am removing the first two cords and the last two cords to keep it out of my way, because we're going to alternate our square knots now. So to alternate, you grab the last two cords from the previous square knot and the first two cords from the second previous square knot and that's how you join them together and alternate them. So again, we're just gonna motor along and finish this row. We're gonna repeat this process until we come to the very last square knot at the bottom. And she should look something like this. Now I'm gonna tie two more cords using a lark's head knot and I'm gonna put them on opposite side of our project here. Okay, so we're going to leave the first strand out and then we're going to grab the second strand and use that as our lead cord. And we are going to tie some double half hitches all the way down to the center. And of course, we're going to do the exact same thing to the opposite side. Just make sure you're leaving out the very last cord. We're going to be using that later. Unfortunately, my birthday landed on a Tuesday, which means on Friday, the day that I'm releasing this video, is the day I get to celebrate. I'm going out to dinner and to a comedy club out in Vancouver, BC with a group of friends. I'm super excited. I love going to comedy clubs. Okay, so this is the only somewhat confusing portion of this project. Those two cords that we had left out, we want to pull them up to the top and we're going to save those for later. And we are going to tie eight cords using the lark's head knot. And now we're going to do the pretty much the exact same thing as the first portion there. And we are going to tie square knots straight across. And then alternate. Next we're going to attach another cord. Okay, remember that cord we had moved out of the way? Now it is time to use it. We are going to tie double half hitches all the way straight down to the center using that cord. And of course we're going to do the same thing to the other side with the cord that we had just attached. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Attach another cord at the very start of this section here. And we are repeating the exact same process as we've been doing this entire time. So let's just skip ahead. Alrighty, this is basically what the crown should look like. We just need to trim the ends. I'm cutting it at about a half an inch away from the double half hitches. Okay, I'm gonna warn you, be very super careful when you cut the ends here. Make sure you do not cut the cord that um, your whole project is on. We need that cord to tie around our head. And all that's left to do is just to comb out our fringe. Thank you for taking the time to watch me be silly on my birthday. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to see more. Also, here are two more videos I think you'll enjoy. I'll see you over there.